So me and Master Chief over here have been doing some digging around this data set that we've been given access to and I've uncovered a couple of patterns here and I'm going to make a very, very, very quick video about it. I'm going to explain basically how it appears that this thing is working. This is information we didn't really have that we kind of suspected, so let's just get right into it. So if I'm on this data set and I just do a quick search for Greg Rakowski, legend. Right, I'm going to notice a pattern here in the domain ID. This is where they are taking this information or this specific image from. And I'm going to see a lot of art station. Art station, art station, art station, art station, art station. You're, you're picking up what I'm putting down, right? It's a pretty easily identified pattern. And if I do another quick search here, search for Craig Mullins, another legend. I'm going to notice another quick pattern. I'm going to see this i.pinimg, pinimga, the pinimga.com. Now, what that is is Pinterest. Those are Pinterest hosting. So, if I just scroll down here in this data set, keeping in mind that this is a very small sampling of the data set that we've been given access to, but it is supposed to be representative. So, I'm going to notice Pinterest, 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 Pinterest whatever the fuck that is Pinterest Pinterest you, you get it right you're you're smelling what we're cooking here okay so now we've established that art station they're getting a lot of stuff from art station and Pinterest they're getting a lot of stuff from Pinterest and you will see third-party websites and you go well okay that's strange why why don't I see Instagram or Twitter because I would have definitely assumed that there was plenty of art uh, sorry Twitter and Instagram stuff but it seems to be a very simple answer to that and that is that if you go to ArtStation and you right click on anything you don't even have to expand the image you just have to right click and you'll see you have save image as and you have copy image. Now, if you go to Instagram and you right click on an image, well, you don't have those. You can't copy the image. You can't save the image as. You have a save as, but that is HTML. So it's real obvious, really quick, what functionality, what method they are using to scrape the data here. So third-party websites generally allow you to right-click and copy an image. Seems to be pretty general internet type of thing, right? Uh, and Instagram and and Twitter don't do that. And it's so f fucking bizarre to say like Instagram is doing something right because I know how we all feel about Instagram these days, but it it's... <sighs> It's so confusing and conflicting, but I feel safer posting my shit to Instagram than ArtStation, even though ArtStation is this really good community with tons of resources that you can actually get work through ArtStation. I've gotten work through Instagram too, actually more than ArtStation, but I'm not as active on ArtStation. So just knowing that, knowing that Pinterest, right, ArtStation, DeviantArt also, which I forgot to mention, is another one of these art communities that is, obviously it's less active than ArtStation, but it's very easy for them to scrape your data. Just knowing this, how do you feel? Do you feel like you planting your artwork in the fields of AI data harvesting just for them to come along with a big machine and, and they just go nom, 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 nom. Is this kind of what's happening? Do you even give a shit? Is that a concern? Do you think that just knowing now how this functionality seems to be working with its either save images or copy image, I'm not sure which one of these two, I don't really think it matters, do you feel safe posting your shit there? Do you think that maybe there's actually an easy fix? Because if you can just eliminate these two features, maybe they can't get your chit. It's an interesting discussion, but this this is what we've uncovered so far. I'm not going to get too into it. This is kind of a bigger topic, and we can kind of go back and forth about if it really matters and, you know, how you feel about it and, you know, what the eventual outcome of what they're doing with this is. Personally, I wouldn't want them to have any of my information. I think there needs to be some sort of opt-out function. But one major thing that could happen right now, if I'm the owner of ArtStation or the head 
coder, whatever the whatever it is, find a way to get rid of this. Absolutely, just remove this from it. Make people have to take screenshots if they want to steal your shit. You know, I'm sure that's going to be a pain in the ass for the AI. I'm sure they'll figure that out too. I mean, I'm, I this would probably be a temporary fix at best. But again, link in the description down below. Feel free to dig around in this data set and just see what you can uncover. I'm totally open to any suggestions. If you know anyone at our station, shout them out, share this video, or just share the database with them and say, hey, your art community is essentially a crop field for AI data training. All right, that's it. Master Chief is very disappointed. He doesn't like it. He's just made out of plastic. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. That's it for today. Peace out.